Hello, this is my Dell Precision T7500 workstation. And from what you can see from my last video, it is quite a powerhouse. Powerful enough to run four monitors at once. There's just one problem. This machine has a bit of a cooling problem. As you can see, the cores are definitely warm not the optimal temperature. They're actually not as bad as they have been in the past, but that's because I'm not really putting too much of a load on there. Even though you see all this running at once, this machine just doesn't care. So I gotta throw something really intense at it. To heat up the CPU, I'm going to be encoding a video of mine. A video I have quite procrastinated on, but that's another subject. Over here, I have Handbrake ready to encode here. I'm going to encode it into X264, and I have it set to placebo. It's a little dark, but it's set to that. And I'm going to hit Start, and you're going to notice a startling rise in CPU temperature. If we look over here, we will notice a startling rise in CPU temperature. This gets the CPUs pretty steamy every time I do something like this. I'm just going to keep climbing higher and higher. I'm not going to let it get too hot though. But this just gives you an example of how much stress this puts it through. The progress is incredibly slow here. It's only at like 2%. You can see right here, it's definitely making it go warm. CPU, oh god, it's going to shut down my machine because I have overheat protection enabled. Oh man. It's probably going to shut it down, yep. Uh, I have my instant shutdown program. Damn it. Yep, there it goes. Oh. <laughs> I have the machine really did shut down. It shut down immediately as a response. And I have it do that because if I'm away from the machine or something that's overheating, then I don't want it to melt out or something. Oh, let's get this beast started up. And I'm going to have the lovely pleasure of reloading again. That was kind of a fail. There is one but only solution to controlling the fan speed of your Dell Precision T7500. And that is speed fan. I'm sure some of you have heard of this program before, but it allows you to control your CPU fan speeds. Or just the fan speeds in your machine in general. Unfortunately, when you first start up and install fan, speed fan, you none of the fans get recognized. And there are no fans here to control. So you would think that you're out of luck with this machine. And Dell didn't add any support which is mostly true, but there is an option. There is a way. You cannot see that, but that button says configure right here. You will want to click configure and then you will want to go to options. In options, you will see right here, there's an option called enable Dell support and it says use this function only on Dell notebooks. Well, this is not a notebook obviously, this is something a little bigger than a notebook, it's a workstation. So, what to do? I just decided to enable this option and I believe I'm taking a risk of some sorts, who knows? And I believe you would be taking a risk too if you enabled this option. But for me, it has had good results. So I will then click OK. The fans will still not be detected, so you have to exit speed fan. And then reopen it. And 
And sure enough, it will start detecting your fans and it will detect their speed and such. Now this is where you can really control things. Unfortunately it doesn't give us too many options here. It seems like when you set this to... it seems like the fans don't actually kick in until you get to above 70 percent so I'll just type in like 80 and then put 80 on all of it. Now their settings seem to range from off to 100% fan speed. There's no happy medium or so. So it's just going to get noisier and noisier. But I don't care about noise. I care about cooling. And I am hoping this will do what it does as it gets progressively louder and louder. As you can see here, the core temperatures will drop slowly. They will respond to this. The fans are not even at their final form yet. They're not even at full speed. They're just going to get faster and faster. Okay, the fan speeds have about plateaued here. And you can see the CPUs are responding to the fans. Which is great. Of course I have the clock rate halved. I can return that to high performance. Or actually balanced. I like balanced better. Well, hope that helps you if you're an owner of a Dell Precision T7500 workstation. I know it's helped me. And now my fan speeds are running like they should be running, actually trying. That's all. Thank you for watching.